So hello everyone, it's Booktube on day two and I am currently dressed up as Karu from Daughter of Smoke and Bone. If you couldn't tell already, got the blue wig on and the leather jacket, the black pants and boots and it's 104 degrees outside and I'm dying. Lesson learned, do not wear leather and all long sleeves and all black in 104 degree weather because you will die. But I really love Daughter of Smoke and Bone. Oh, you can totally see my hairline, good job. Gosh, these things are so annoying, you can see it. There was this little piece of wig that was cut and then every time I move the hair of the wig you can see it it's really annoying but anyways I really love daughter smoke and bone and it took me a long time to think of an idea of where I could create the book scene or what book scene to create and eventually I came up with this one because I had the blue wig and I've only worn the blue wig once and that was for my Karoo cosplay that I did back in October and obviously hair doesn't start right here I should probably so yeah, this was so much fun. Uh, I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for watching. And right now, it's the middle of the day as I'm filming this and I've already completed Furthermore by Tahara Mafi. I ended up really enjoying it. I'm giving it three and a half out of five stars on Goodreads, primarily because I really love the world and the writing in this book, but I didn't. I wasn't a huge fan of the characters and the way that the book ended. I think that there could have been a better way to do that, but because it's an arc, and I looked up how many pages are in the final copy of Furthermore, and there are 416 in my copy, there's only 300 and something, so they could have filled in the ending a little bit more, which is something that really irritated me. They could have done that in the final copy of the book, I'm not sure, but I'm definitely planning on purchasing it once it does come out, you know, support those authors. Because overall, it is a fantastic book, and I really, really enjoyed it, despite the couple of issues that I had with it. And I'm also listening to The Hunger Games, which fulfills the challenge. Read slash watch a book to movie adaptation, and I'm going to be watching The Hunger Games sometime soon. Soon. Hopefully it's on Netflix. It's not. I'll find a way. So yes, I hope that you guys who are participating are having an awesome readathon so far. And please ignore the noise. I know it's really annoying. As for my reading plans for tonight, I'm planning on finishing up listening to The Hunger Games over the course of today, and then I'm going to start reading The Savage Song by Victoria Schwab so that I can fulfill the challenge of read a book only after dark. Hopefully, I'm going to read it for like an hour or two every night so that I can have it finished up by the end of this readathon. But yes, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you guys are having a great readathon. My name is Mila and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Read slash slash slash.